Well, it is slick on the roads out there tonight. Hundreds of slide offs halted traffic around the region all day. Kex Y Ford's Ian Cole joined us live along Interstate 90. How does it look out there right now, Ian? Yeah, very slick from this afternoon all the way to right now. We were just driving along the South Hill, very slick, and I-90, especially eastbound, backed up at this point all the way back almost into downtown Spokane. WSP says there uh, is a slide off. Three semis are partially blocking Broadway. Uh, that is causing a little bit of uh, rubbernecking as well as uh, some problems with people getting off on that exit. So. Uh, you may want to avoid I-90 if possible or avoid the roads at all if you can. Now, the city of Spokane is not at a stage one snow event yet, a spokesman told me this afternoon, uh, but it could happen soon. They have 16 snow plows out right now with de-icer and sand along arterials. Uh, they say that they're not at a stage one because although we do have two or more inches uh, that more snow really wasn't in the forecast right away. Uh, as Chris just told us, though, the snow will continue through the night, so you might expect that within the next hour. We'll have an update on that as well. Now, uh, this morning, Mayor David Conan gave the city's overall snow removal uh, for the year at a grade of B+. Plus. He thinks the city is improving its communication with its residents. Now, back here, also along I-90 and Arthur, you can see we're we're looking back into Spokane here. We gave you a look towards Spokane Valley. Now this is back to downtown, basically. Even at Arthur here near the South Perry District, backed up uh, all the way at this stop sign here at Arthur and Fifth Avenue. It's slow all over. It's slick all over. SPD said they responded to about 30 either slide offs or crashes since early this morning to about 4 p.m. The sheriff's office responded to about 60 and uh, WSP to about 16. Now that is going to continue to go up. They're all asking people to drive very slow tonight if possible and avoid the roads if possible at all.